Eso es Pepe. Pepe. Nuestro Pepe. Uh -huh. Y para darlo. Nuestro para darlo. Eso es para pegar cosas. Cosas. Yo coño. Unicornio. Yo coño, yo coño. Yo coño. No va a coger eso, yo coño. No va a coger eso, yo coño. Coge. Coge, mamá. No te ves, te vas a botarlo. Y no lo bote. No, tengo que botarlo. Botarlo. Good morning. ¿Y por qué botaste? Porque casi te lo metiste en la boca. So, this is a realistic day. I know I haven't posted in a while, but there's a perfectly good explanation for that. And it's this. That there isn't. <laughs> Except for the fact. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't know. I just, I thought I was ready. I guess I wasn't ready. I don't know. I, I guess at this point, you know, I'm still figuring out my health. Um, <coughs> I've decided that I'm just going to post when I can and when I'm feeling okay. And today I just kind of felt like filming a realistic day and this is a realistic day this is what I look like when I wake up I wear this mask to sleep if you guys um, don't wear sleeping masks to sleep I never used to until I discovered this one it's like a blanket for your face so it doesn't feel like a regular face mask it feels like a blanket and I love it because it like it's just so comfortable it's almost like cold and I get a lot of headaches and it feels good on my face and like ever since that I started using it when I don't use it I feel like I open my eyes a lot when I sleep now because like anything bothers me and when I wake up I keep it up here I don't know why I, like for comfort like it feels good up here like as if I'm still sleeping or I don't know I just keep it here for a while in my robe my pajamas until I'm ready to like get out of my clothes um, it's about like 10 something I, I want to get a lot done today um, and my plans today are as follows change I have to take care of her all day my, um, <coughs> but yeah, my mom today she's pressure cleaning the front and the back because we put we put lights up so <laughs> she's rubbing my back we put christmas lights up so she wants the like the front and the back to look nice so i've been taking care of her all day Mama, Mia. with no help you guys know how much i need my mom to help me el cielo yeah so the plan for today is going to be try to manage to do everything with her by my side all day today. And... Con la cámara. Con la cámara. Yeah. Okay. Porque estoy haciendo un video. Video. Yeah. yeah. I'm going to show you guys my new machine if you guys haven't already seen it. Oh. I actually got it a few weeks ago. But I just... My energy levels have been so low. They've been so to the floor that I just haven't found the energy to um, mm -hmm. film to film a video. But guys, this machine. I'm gonna film myself using it today. Mm -hmm. You guys don't understand. This machine is a freaking beast. This is the the MT2001, the 20 needle by Ricoma. You guys know me and Ricoma. We buddies. So, um, they sent me this machine and I am obsessed with it. I've used it a few times already. So I plan on putting some stuff on my machines. I, um, I then have to give her lunch and then she's going to go down for a nap. I really want to create a setup here 
for my work computer. Like my, but let's see if I accomplish Mama, any yeah. of that today. Mama, here. So I will see you guys on the later. So I just spent the last hour looking for my adapter so I can get my monitor set up in here and I could not find it anywhere. And I found it, I, I went into the office and I checked the first two drawers of my office um, desk. And it was in the third drawer. I didn't check the third drawer. I spent an hour looking. All because I didn't check the third drawer. Anyway, got myself set up. My little setup. Right here. So, well, I have this set up here so while I have the embroidery machines going, I can be um, working and answering emails. The reason that I'm doing this is because I'm currently training um, two new employees in the office and in the office where I work and I, I've been trying to be caught up and this is loud. Yeah, baby. I've been trying to be caught up before I go in because um, I try to spend some time with them and then while I'm in the office I get a lot of calls for me. The more emails come in which makes me more behind so I'm trying to catch up um, now so that when I go into work tomorrow I'm good to be able to walk away and you know I'm just gonna go in really quick answer a few emails and then I'm gonna start setting up to work on my embroidery stuff and my new machine <laughs> Right. Let's go to the kitchen, make the baby some lunch, and then hopefully put her <laughs> So I have a, a camping tent on the floor because I wanted to do an activity with the baby, like sleep with her in a tent last night, but I realized that you can't really put a tent up in your own home. You need to put the sticks in the dirt, and I don't have dirt in my house, so that was a fail. But we made s'mores, so that was fun. I'm watching RuPaul's Drag Race. Well, not RuPaul's, Canada's Drag Race versus the world. New season. So good. All right, so I'm going to um, embroider this blanket that I got for my boss's daughter. She, um, it was her birthday two weeks ago. And I couldn't go, and so I got her this blanket. She loves unicorns and rainbows and stuff, so I want to um, embroider it with her name. And my boss has been out of town, so I also haven't been able to give it to her. So I just I haven't embroidered it because she hasn't been there. So she's going to be there tomorrow, but it's the cutest blanket. It's a, a unicorn hood. And it has like these little things here where I think they could put their hands in it. Yeah, their little hands. And it's the cutest blanket. So I think I'm gonna put her name like in a corner right here in um, rainbow letters. And then um, I'm going to hoop it with the. Um, Hoop it with the blanket hoop that the Ricoma comes with. And grab it. So this is the blanket um, piece. And I'm just going to put it here. So let's bring you guys in closer. Check it out. Look at my babies. So this is the Ricoma MT2001. And this thing, man, it is a completely different animal. It is so strong, so heavy duty. It has 20 needles. The display on it is, um, I like the display on this one better than the display on the 1501. It's a little bit more more modern, um, and it's just 20 needles. It's just insane. And a difference that you'll also notice is that I have a table on this one, and no table 
on the other one. The other one also came with a table, but the problem with the tables is that if you do shirts, you can't hoop shirts with when you have the table um, attachment. So that's the only unfortunate thing about the table. But I have, since I have two machines, I have a table on one and, a ta and no table on the other so that we can at least have space to put things. And when you make blankets and stuff, the table comes in handy because if you're, if you're embroidering a blanket and there's no table, it kind of, the blanket will be heavy and it'll push, it'll pull the hoop down, making the stitching to kind of like stretch and come out wrinkly. So if you guys do a lot of blankets or a lot of really large things, um, like big, big hoodies that you can actually, you know, move out and don't have to put under the, um, the arm, I definitely recommend the, um, the table because it's a must. Like, you saw the blanket. It has a big-ass head. Like, if I would do that on the other machine, I would have to hold up the blanket the entire time. So I like the fact that I have this machine with the table and then the other machine without it. But, um, yeah, this machine has a lot of things. Obsessed with my machine. You guys know I have a link down below if you guys are interested. Um, but, yeah, Ricoma, I love them. I've been working with them now for like two and a half years and my relationship with them is I'm, I love them like I have such a great relationship with them I they're just amazing So I'm going to use sticky stabilizer and then before I start embroidering I'm going to put regular um, cutaway stabilizer underneath like loosely and then I'm going to put on top of the fluffiness I'm going to put um, I don't know what the stabilizer is but it's this one the one that goes on top. Alright, so now I'm going to work on the design and then I'm going to put it in the machine. And, and I'll show you guys what that looks like once I'm done. So this is what it looks like. Cute. I'm going to do the name in rainbow and then the, um, the butterflies in like a peachy color with a gold inside. So cute. Okay, so this hoop in particular, I have to um, use a screwdriver to screw it in, so since it's so big. But, Ricoma comes with a handy dandy tool kit, like a legit tool kit, like, look at this. <laughs> legit comes with a lot, with legit ass tool kits. You, you like it had, there's everything in here whatever you can think of and I took out of that toolbox I took out like the daily stuff and I put it in this little plastic box that we always keep at the back of the machine so in there we have like extra needles and like a little allen wrench screwdriver the USBs etc etc and also I don't know if you noticed but I hooped this upside down so this is where I put it into the machine the blanket comes out on the other side you need to and then when I put the design on the machine I'm just gonna flip it so that it, it embroiders upside down because I can't put all of this on the other side of the machine so just make sure you keep that in mind when doing blankets Alright, so I put my design on the USB, 
I put the, it's really dark on the sides because I had to make it dark so you're able to see what I'm doing on the screen. And now I'm going to go grab my design. Okay, so, all right, so I have my design set and now I'm going to change the, I want it to be upside down. So I'm gonna put the upside down F. Okay. So I put it upside down. Go back, and then I'm gonna set the colors. To set the colors, you do it right over here. I have to switch out some of the threads, but do it right over here. And then you choose the numbers corresponding with where the threads are. And then that's it. I'll be right back. So it's the next day. <clears throat> the design finished, but I didn't take it out of the um, machine because I had to give the baby a bath, I had to give the baby dinner. I was really freaking tired and I just, I went to sleep at 8.30. Literally, 8.30. So I'm gonna take it out of the machine right now, prep it, because I gotta go to work. Screwdriver. <laughs> Yesterday, I didn't know the name of this stabilizer that goes on top. It's called and it's a water soluble stabilizer. Just remember the name right now. Look at how cute it came out. Obsessed. All right, guys, thank you so, so, so much for watching. I am going to try and film more, but it all depends on how I'm feeling. But hopefully, I can post more. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.